All right, we're doing the blood board and blood cells uh, as a review. So this is the blood board. This has a smattering of all the different cells. It's fairly easy to identify them. We have the red blood cells or erythrocytes. We have a bunch of different white blood cells. We have little platelets. And then we have the, the plasma of the blood. It's supposed to represent our blood slide, like the slides we were looking at. Okay. On here you have different white blood cells. You also have them here for you to look at. Uh, so let's start with these. So this is the neutrophil. It has a multi-lobulated nucleus and you see small granules, okay? Vesicles filled with digestive enzymes. This is our lymphocyte. These we're referring to as our monocytes. You see the kind of kidney-shaped nucleus, and we're including this because it kind of has a kidney-shaped nucleus. So we're using those as our monocytes. This is our eosinophil, big, robust, dark, red, brownish staining granules. Again, a multilobulated nucleus. These are our basophils, dark, black, purplish staining granules, multilobulated nucleus, red blood cell, and platelets. Clotting, carrying oxygen and to some degree carbon dioxide, and different types of white blood cell function. Uh, acute inflammation, repairing, healing, immune surveillance, I mean, different things for, for different cells. But these all are found in the blood. And then here we have, again, representation. So neutrophil, these are our neutrophils. There's one here, 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 here. Okay. These Lymphocytes, here, here, here. Monocytes, here, here, here. Our eosinophil, we have one here because the granules have a little bit of reddish to them as compared to none. Here and here. And one basophil, right here. 